Missing that key player to complete the God Squad. Well, check out Buy My Coins for instant delivered Madden coins and be sure to use code SAVAGE at checkout for 10% off. Yo, guys, what is going on? It's Savage here. And today, fellas, today is a freaking great day because it's Thursday. Weekend League Rewards are out. There's a limited edition Luke Kigley and limited edition Malcolm Jenkins in packs. And your boy finished 25 in the world with a record of technically 22 and 3. So, with all of that being said, I need you guys to right now comment down below, Pack Luck. I need you guys to smack some big fat thumbs up on the button. Because right now, man, every single week, we freaking made a half a million coins, which is crazy. I would love to see this week us make over 1 million coins. So, if you guys smack that like button, let's try to get over 500 likes. The last one got over 1,100 likes, which was crazy. But if we could get over 500 likes on this video, and we could get enough comments saying Pack Luck, I really do truly believe that we will have enough positivity to pull something or some things worth 1 million coins for a 25 in the world finish. Finish 25th in the world, about to hop into Ultimate Team, man. I'm super amped up, and as always, let me know what you guys got out of your weekend league rewards and where you placed and where you're looking to place this weekend. And after we're done opening our packs, we are going to upgrade the offensive line a little bit with some of the players that you guys suggested. But with all of that being said, we are going to now... Hop an ultimate team. Here we go, baby. Oh my god. I would love a limited edition pool. I would love, I would just love something like that, man. Like a limited time pool. Something that just that just shakes, just shakes the freaking ground and it makes the ground shake, bro. We get all these damn tokens. Look at all the tokens that we got. We could put them in the set. We got four of those mega packs, bro. Four of them. And as always, man, if you are new around here, and let's just say you've never even seen a weekend league pack opening or you don't know what weekend league is, pretty much every weekend, you got to play 25 games. And however many games you win throughout that weekend, put you on a leaderboard. And that leaderboard will obviously go from 100 to 1. Um, and once you're done, once all, your, all the 25 games are done on Monday, you can see where you finished and depending on where you finished you get exclusive rewards then if you get into the top 100 you get really exclusive rewards uh including these mega elite tier weekend league packs pretty much inside of this pack there are three cards each the first two cards are can be anything and then the last card is a guaranteed 84 overall player or higher I want to pull a legend. I want to pull at least a piece of a legend. I want to pull something maybe that's like an 89 overall or higher, 88 overall even. An 88 overall legend still sells for over 100k. So if we could get that four times, I'd be super satisfied. But with all that being said, fellas, we are about to hop into our first weekend league pack. We got, we got four chances this week, man. We got four freaking chances, bro. This is crazy. Here we go. First card in the pack. First card in the pack is an 81 Carlos High. That's okay, though. It's always the last card, fellas. This last card is the one. Okay. I didn't even know that I could pull them. Okay. I didn't even know you could pull them. But this card right here is still guaranteed to be an 84 overall or higher. I, if it's like a Vic or something, I'm freaking out. But that 85 Andrew Luck's kind of cool though. Let's see what we get. Oh my God. See, man. I really personally believe that. I per Now, I'm going to go on a little rant right here. But I personally believe that when you get top 100, man, you, th this should be an 86 or higher, bro. Really, 84 high? Like, bro, I'm, I'm playing 25 games a weekend. I, I think I think the people that are finishing at the very top deserve a little bit better, a little bit better chance of pulling something crazy just to, just to help the market crash a little bit because some cards are made expensive. But the first pack was kind of meh, but we still got three chances, bro, and everything's profit, profit. So, I mean, I don't really care too much. I mean, I, I can still get coins, but I, I it just kind of sucks when, when you don't get, like, that mega advancement pull. And I'm ready right here. We're going to go backwards. Now, I'm feeling it. I feel, 80, I feel like 87 or higher. 87 or higher? Okay, Derek Carr. I'll take that. I don't know how much he goes for, but I will take a Derek Carr any day of the week. I know he has the power upset, so maybe that makes his price go up a little bit. But we haven't had that wow, wow, wow pull like we did last week when we pulled the 89 Rodney Harrison. Now, right here, can we pull something crazy? Can I pull Can I pull like a Vic? Can I? I, I, don't, I don't think they're going to give me a Vic. They're going to give me Kyle. They're going to be Jeremy. Please, 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 please. Really, man? For 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 top 25 in the world, I got an 86 that probably sells for like 45k. I got an 87 that probably I don't even know. I'm a little confused right now. I'm a, I'm a little I'm a little bit confused, but but it is profit, so I gotta be happy. We get an Andrew Whitworth. We get a Hunter Henry. Give me a 90. We get an 85 Kirk Cousins, bro. I'm actually I'm actually really mad, bro. This is our first week I didn't even make. I don't even think I made 100k off these players. Well, no, I, mean, I might have made 100k. Bro. Bro. Hold up. 
I'm checking up. Bro, for, 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 for finishing 25th in the entire world, I pulled a card worth about... Okay, that, that actually might... Their car high key... Alright, I undersold that pull. I undersold that pull. I didn't think their car still went for that much. What the heck? Okay, but real realistically, Derek Derek Carr low key saved this. I mean, I made about if I if I if I'm correct, I think these 85 ones, yeah, they go for about like 30k. So that's 30, 60, 90, and a 140. That's 230 plus. So we made like 330k. But still though, man, like for I don't I mean, if you guys don't play all 25 games, or if you do, you know how long that takes, and to only get one card really that's worth anything kind of sucks man that's kind of like a slap in the face now i'm not i'm not obviously trying to sound like greedy or anything but at the same time i know i probably do sound pretty greedy but damn really uh i'm, I'm just a little blown away i am a little blown away but with all that being said like i said we we just got to be thankful that it's profit um that that ain't too bad that that I, I i guess it's i guess it's pretty good i guess it's better than than the average pull rate so i can't be too mad at it and uh yeah i mean i'm gonna go look now at some of the 86 to 87 um left tackles that are in the game and i want to go buy some i really want to buy a little bit of an upgrade on the o-line so i mean we could get this donald penn right here oh uh, okay let's see how much better he is than my current left tackle He's just like a little bit less athletic. Is Bruce Matthews any more athletic than my current left tackle? Because if, if my if Bruce Matthews is a little athletic, he's got he's got damn he's got 90 stamina and he's just a little bit he's just a little bit slower and that's actually kind of no that's actually kind of weird though because his impact blocking was oh my god his impact blocking was kind of trash right there. Let's see what we got right here. Nah, David Bakatari is pretty much the same as as Nate Solder. I'm sorry if that's not how you pronounce his name. I apologize. I, I'm, I'm a lot of people were suggesting Cowboys players. Guys, I'm not freaking, I don't have a billion coins. My, my defense is my main priority, so I might not be able to get all the Cowboys offensive linemen. How much are the Cowboys offensive linemen? I think, I think isn't Frederick like an 80? Yep, whoever suggested Travis Frederick is freaking crazy. I can't afford Travis. I can't, I'm sorry. I could get Rodney. I could get good old Rodney. I, I'm, how much is Rodney? Rodney only got 77 strength. Rodney, you got to get your weight up. I'm trying to think though, who do I... Who should we buy right now? I feel like the baby legend pieces are always the wave, to be honest with you. Like, wow, wait, right guards are this cheap? Yo, how much is this AJ can? Okay. Hey, he, he has way better everything. He has nine better pass blocking. And everything else is like a little bit lower. I already have a Larry Allen right now. I could get Warford. How much better is this Warford? I, I'm definitely building an O-line before the end of this video. Nothing really for Warford. Nothing really too much for Warford. Oh, David DeCastro, though. David DeCastro. He's pretty freaking good. Okay, he has a little bit less impact blocking, but he has way better strength. Way I think DeCastro is going to be the wave at right guard. Unless, unless how, how good is Sitton? Sitton looks pretty nice. Sitton does look pretty nice, but I, I think I'm actually going to wind up taking DeCastro over him. Ooh, or this new Shaq Mason? Hold up. Nah, I think I'm going to go DeCastro. Yeah, I'm going to Castro at right guard. So, fellas, we are our first a new acquisition for the team is going to be David DeCastro, right guard from the Pittsburgh Steelers. Now, what we have to do is, is we have to. I'm going to definitely try to get at least one more lineman before the end of the video uh, for you guys to see. And then what I'm going to do is is just sell car and then probably bring out like a lineup update out on like tomorrow when I um, am playing my weekend league games. How much are 90 overall? Okay, there is none. All right, never mind. I'm going to go right back down to my budget. Right back down to 86 to 87. I don't care. I'm freaking getting 86 to 87s. Oh, Joel Batonio. Joel Batonio is probably pretty freaking nice. He's really weak looking though. He's mad weak looking. How much? Wait, how much is right tackles? I could get Brian Bulaga. Is he, is he much better than my current right tackle? Oh, my current right tackle is unauctionable. So never mind. I, I don't need a right tackle. I'm going to go back to left tackles. I want to go back to left tackles. I honestly am just thinking about getting either Bakhtari or Donald Penn. I think I'm going to get Bakhtari. He has a little bit better pass blocking. Same impact blocking. He's just like a little bit slower and that's it. That's really all the difference. I don't know though. Do I really want that? Do I want to take that risk? Or I could get Luan. Taylor Luan. Wow. Yo. Luan high key the wave. He's literally just like an upgrade in Nate Solder. Yo. I kind of want that card. 
Or do I want to... Who's the left guards again? Oh, yeah. B Batonio, who I can't get yet. Batonio, who I can't get. Uh... Oh, wait. I'm going to see how much Ali Marpet is really quick. Let me see how good he is. He has a little bit better pass blocking. Less impact. Oh, man. Marpet might be the wave. Marpet might be the go-to. How much is this? How much is Brandon Linder? Er, wow. Wow. We're getting Linder. Everybody, welcome Linder. That right there is going to complete the freaking upgrades that we make during this video. And then once I sell Derek Carr and the other cards that we got from the weekend league, we are going to 100% upgrade the rest of the offensive line for this weekend's weekend league. But as of right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to plug in our two newest acquisitions, who is Brandon Linder. And of course, the man with the plan, David DeCascro. I, I just changed up his name a little bit. But fellas, I hope you guys did enjoy my weekend league, league, league rewards this week. I mean, I myself, I'll take it. But it definitely is kind of a little like, you know, like a like a shot in the face when, when you don't pull like a, a banger card. So yeah, man. I mean, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to smack a big fat thumbs up on the button. And as always, bros, I hope you guys got way better rewards than me this week. That's all I really care about is what you guys get. I, like, I can get coins by just buying packs and stuff. But yeah, man, be sure to subscribe if you are new around here. Comment down below what you got. Have a wonderful rest of your night, fellas.